everyone, welcome back. We've got a treat for you today. We're looking at the all-new Bellroy Flight Bag, a slim and beautiful carry-on bag for professional travel. I'm Ed from Rush Faster and we do guides and walkthroughs bringing you better gear and better ways to carry. So if you're new to the channel or interested in anything like that, please consider subscribing. Let's jump right in and check out the Bellroy Flight Bag. Just recently, Bellroy have released a whole bunch of new travel bags, the Transit Backpack Plus, the Weekender, the Weekender Plus, and the Flight Bag. A bag that's perfect for those short business trips or accompanying a larger travel luggage. Today, we have it here in one of Bellroy's newer colors, Marine Blue, which is made of this beta nylon. The really tight weave allows the fabric to be resistant to water and wear, and it's a completely unique look and feel. All the leathers that you'll find on this bag are premium environmentally certified leathers from Bellroy, and you'll find plenty of sturdy and reliable YKK zips. In this video, we're gonna cover the features, the compartments, and different ways to carry the flight bag. Getting into the front of the Bellroy flight bag, we have a beautiful little leather brand mark here from Bellroy, which is a nice touch. And then behind that, we have our first zippered compartment. This is a bit of an organization compartment to help you store your quick access items when traveling. Here on the left, we've got a little slip pocket which we can put some gear inside. I'm gonna put my wired earphones in there and also my Bluetooth wireless earphones. There's also a little pen slip here which you can uh, pop in a pen or a stylus if you're carrying a tablet. I'm just gonna chuck in my Lamy pen in there. And then on the other side, we have another stash pocket, which I'm going to put my Bellroy travel folio inside. You also notice behind the travel folio, this piece of fabric, this ribbon here, it's actually a key leash for attaching your keys to. So when you do go traveling, you want to bring your home keys with you. Just attach this on here. And just keep our keys in one safe place. Now in this compartment, there is space to just put other bits of gear inside. So I'm just going to put some hand sanitizer and my sunglasses case. Now getting to the hall handles of the bag, we've got these beautiful thick leather hall handles which have this uh, exposed hide on the underside of the hall handles which is a really nice touch to have that kind of raw leather feeling. So that's nice. Turning now to the back of the bag, we've got a little compartment here and we've got this hall handle strap which is actually a luggage pass-through. So if you're using the Bellroy flight bag as a carry-on and then you've got an accompanying larger travel luggage for check-in, um, you can actually slip through the trolley handle of the larger check-in through this pass-through and then just carry both of them at once, which is really helpful and almost essential for a lot of these carry-on bags. But another great carry feature of this bag is that Bellroy has included backpack shoulder straps to the flight bag. They're just stowed away behind this little zipper here, so we can pull them out. And they simply clip onto these loops here on the bag so that you can attach the backpack straps. They use a fairly simple C-clip mechanism here. Um, and to release the C-clip, you simply pinch the buckle and it releases. Then we can clip that down and we've got our backpack strap attached. Pinch and attach. Very easy actually. As for the shoulder straps themselves, we've got these mesh foam padding, uh, which is reasonably padded and they are decently tapered so they'll fit along the body nicely. You also can't ignore the inclusion of strap keepers for a bit of strap management, just making it a bit less dangly with that excess strap, so that's good. And actually stowed away inside the zippered compartment is a little hall handle here, just for another option of picking up the bag off the ground. Now, if you want to carry this bag as a brief or as a shoulder bag, then you can stow away these backpack straps very easily. Pinch, undo the buckle, pinch, and undo the buckle. And we can stow these away with ease. Now because this is the back side of the bag, the actual fabric is reasonably thick and so you won't be feeling all of those little bits and pieces when you do carry it over the shoulder and along your waist so that you won't feel any of those bumps which is also very important. Now getting onto the rear compartment, 
we have another chunky YKK zipper here. And as you can see, this is a compartment for your laptop or tablet. This is a fleeced line padded compartment that will fit laptops up to 16 inches. So this is my 13 inch MacBook Pro Retina. Fits in there with plenty of space on the sides. This is gonna fit a 16 inch laptop. And the fleece lining is great to protect your laptop from scratches and bumps. But behind that we have another slip pocket which you can put also other documents in. Maybe some reading material. And that fits in there nicely. Now before we get into the main compartment you may have noticed this little loop here. And also this loop here that we saw earlier. Those loops there are actually attachment points for the shoulder strap which is a, another carry option for this bag. It's got a fairly padded shoulder pad here, um, which will do well to provide comfort, and it curves and bends very easily. And it's got some simple adjustment with these brushed metal ladder locks, and then simple clips here to attach onto those loops. So another option for you in carrying the flight bag. Alrighty, so let's get onto the main compartment of the Bellroy flight bag. We've got a chunky YKK zip here. The flight bag opens completely clamshell, which is very good for us. We've got two sides here to organize and separate your travel gear. Over here is where you'll be putting most of your clothes. And here we've got a clip that just helps secure all your gear. We're gonna undo that for now. So say on one side, you're gonna put all your t-shirts. Another side, you're gonna put your pants. And here we've got a stretch mesh compartment to organize your socks and underwear. So here we've got some socks. Here. And then space for underwear. Really nifty compartment just to separate that. Now it's totally up to you how you want to organize your gear. You might be storing a lot more clothes or you have a packing cube of sorts. Here I've just got a packing cube from Lander and I could put that in there. It'll still fit even though it's getting quite packed now. So what we're going to do is just secure this down. This clip here is a magnetic clip, so it'll secure magnetically and hold, which is really nifty. And say for this mesh compartment, if you've got a packing cube to store all your socks and jocks, you don't have to put it in this compartment here. Um, you can put in some tech gear or some toiletries, what have you. Moving on to the other side. This compartment is a little bit different. We've got a mesh divider just to separate your gear. But inside there, we've got another two mesh dividers for organizing your gear. So I've got a little dot kit from Chrome, which I'm gonna just pop in here. And it fits almost perfectly in that compartment. And then I've got a little bit more tech gear that I'd like to put in this compartment here. I've got my lacy portable hard drive that I'll need. I've got my Nomad Kevlar Universal Cable and I've got my Satoshi USB hub for charging all my tech. I'm just going to put that all in there. I'm also carrying my Roost laptop stand uh, for my laptop. And I'm just going to slot that underneath here. There's a little bit of space here that's perfect pretty much for the Roost laptop stand, so I'm putting it there. Now, you could keep this as is, or you can put a bit more gear inside here. I might just put in a dress shirt just to separate that from the rest of my clothes. Keep that flat. And there we have all our gear packed in and secured. Now all of that gear fits in there pretty well. It's not really pushing the limits of the bag. Uh, it's actually done quite well to accommodate all of that gear. Now it goes without saying that this bag does have a shape to it. There is form to the bag. It's not completely hard shell like a traditional rolling luggage, um, but it is soft shell and that works to the flat bag's advantage. It accommodates and flexes to what you're storing inside the bag itself, but also it has some flex and give when you're putting it in airplane cabins and things like that. Now I'm going to show you some ways on how you can carry the Bellroy flight bag. Obviously you can carry it like a brief, but you can also carry it on the shoulder. You can also carry it over the shoulder. There's also backpack carry.
And don't forget there's also the luggage pass through. Well everyone, there you have it, the Bellroy Flight Pack. A great professional travel bag, perfect for those short term business trips, but also just great as a sleek and functional solution for a carry on bag. Now if you're interested in getting this bag, there's going to be some affiliate links in the description below. If you liked this video, you enjoyed it, you found it helpful for you, then please consider using some of those affiliate links as they really help us out in making more of this kind of content. And even if you're not thinking about getting this bag, but you enjoyed this video and you want to support our work, then hit the like button, hit the bell, let us know in the comments what you thought about this bag, what you think about this video, give us some feedback. And as always, subscribe to see more Carrigy walkthroughs if you haven't already. If you want to see more videos like this or more videos on Bellroy travel bags, then check out some of the links on the screen at the end of this video but for now this has been the Bellroy flight bag take care and we'll see you next time